not your friend. Jesus may be your friend, but the Father is not your friend. A reverential respect and honor and girl must be on top of our list to honor and respect the God, the Father. Jesus Christ said, you are no more servant, you are my friend. But you can't go to the Father and say, I'm your friend. You got to show respect. You got to bow on your knees and worship him. So we look into St. Luke chapter 11 verse 2. He says, our Father, showing you that there must be an intimate relationship between the Father and Son and you yes. and your God yeah. this new relationship comes to you because you are born again Amen. Yes. Yes. To the yes. 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 this intimate relationship yes. is a family affairs yes. because you are now in Christ born of the Spirit of God yes. This family relationship means you can now speak boldly to your God. Amen. What does it mean? Yeah. Well, the writer writes in Hebrews chapter 4, verse 16, you must come boldly to the throne of grace. Yeah. Yeah. And what you understand is that the whole testament says could not approach the throne of grace. Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. The throne of grace was open. Only to the high priest in the Old Testament, yes. not the people. You know, go on your knees and pray to God. You have to do it through the high priest. Yes. <laughs> and only once a year is allowed to go before God. Yes. Oh, Jesus. The Old Testament is the Old Testament saints show respect in such a way that they refuse to call him by name. All right, now. Right. And you'll talk about your, the man upstairs. Come on, now. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> I said the Old Testament will yeah. not call God by name. Mm -hmm. They reverence him too much. Yeah. But you with your uncircumcised heart, yes, sir. Mm -hmm. talk about the man upstairs. Yeah. That is your friend. Yeah. Why are you talking like the pastor? I'm taking up for God. Yes, sir. Amen. Amen. Hallelujah. 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 Hmm? Glory. The Old Testament says could not approach the throne of grace. Only, could not. Only the high priest could. Priest. Not even the other priest them. No. Only the high priest. High priest. And when him going before God, he must stop at the front gate of the Holy of Holies and yeah. wash himself up. Yes. Nothing they call lava. Yes. And if anybody should come and touch him, I'll go back in the water and be there again. Yes. Yes. And you talk about the man upstairs. So if you know you mean, sir, talk about the man upstairs, cut you out. Yes. So the children are going to bar the priest. Yes could not go for themselves right. like we can today yes. under the new covenant yes. which is a better covenant yes. we are in Christ, in Christ. and he is the high priest yes. and we are of his royal priesthood Hallelujah. we are God's new creation created in Christ Jesus in the image of Christ yes. to praise the Lord yes. oh God Amen. And you don't know something, you know I know something. John chapter 17 declare who we are. Let me just read two verses. You can read the rest when you have time. Verse 20. Neither I pray for these alone, but for them also which shall believe on me through their words, that they all may be one as thou father art in me and I in thee that they also may be one in us that the world may believe that thou hast sent me 
So Jesus Christ said, Lord, Father, make them one with us. Under the New Testament, you can go to the throne of grace anytime. Because everyone who is born again become priest. Royal priest. And you have the right to go to God any time of the day you feel like. Holy yes. Spirit could not do that. They are under law. We are under grace. Yes. So the name of God, our Father, is to be hallowed. We must express the longing for. From our hearts, we must magnify Him and glorify Him. We are to adore Him and look for His kingdom to come here on earth as it is in heaven. Praise the Lord. So Luke 11 now one shows us that this prayer is an instruction on how to pray. Begin with an illustration and the variety of request that one should make to God. First, there must be a humble attitude. And that should accompany your prayer. Oh God. And listen, the use of the, the use of the word or the pronoun, plural pronoun, us. Draw the prayer. So it is not just the prayer of one person for his own personal needs, but for a community of prayer. Right, no. Your community. Yes, sir. In other words, we are looking at the subject of the fear of the Lord, Hallelujah. which is to reverence Him. Yes. And so when you go before God, so go for yourself alone. Praise the Lord. Yes, sir. Stop, go to God for yourself alone. As a matter of fact, you will better off going for others and live yourself out. Because God will always supply a needed request. With a request, God will give it to you. If you look about others before. Yes, sir. So look 11 and 2. We well, don't know what well, this is wonderful, though. We, we see the word, our Father. Not my Father, but our Father. That means your prayer, your prayer should be like Jeremiah. Jeremiah never prayed and said, Hi, Jeremiah Samson. He said, Hoss. <laughs> when they go against God, he said, Hoss. Include yourself in it. Our right, oh, Father. So God must be approached confidently. He must approach the throne of us with great boldness. So God is approached with confidence as a caring figure. Hallowed be thy name. So you must approach God with an intimacy attitude. Yes. There must be total respect Amen. and recognition of his unique hallowed mean. Oh gosh. Amen. Hallowed mean God is holy. Yes. Set apart unique. In character, Amen. unique in attributes. Yes, Jesus. So come, let us adore Him, yes. magnify Him, reverence Him in all our ways. Let us bow down and worship Him, for He is Lord. Yes. He is the only true God. Yes, yes sir. Is the God we call to praise Him, praise Him in all our ways. In every way of our life, we must praise Him. Amen. Praise the Lord. Amen. And nobody be no hypocrite. Amen. Amen. Yes. When, we, when I just got saved, a lady come out of the supermarket. Then my wife was right there with the cart. And when she looked, she get back $20 over change. Before she came back, you know, she said, Thank you, Jesus. That. I said, What? She said, Give me what she said. Thank you, Jesus. And she gone. Uh -uh. Yes, oh, my 
Ay, ay, ay. At the same time, at the same time, my wife and I went to the same supermarket. Buy some stuff I have, some man I need the bottom. When we come with they never charge for what I need the bottom. We push by the car, go back in and say, never charge us for this. You can't just talk life. You have to live life. Praise the Lord. Because, let me give you a quick joke where uh, your pastor preaches a sermon in Jamaica. Men I laughed at it till I almost crack up. It says this man was a thief. And every time I thief, he carried son with him. And he looked down the road, and he looked up the road, and then going to thief the yam. And he did it for a while, and then one night, he come and look up the road, looking around, his son said to him, Papa, why you always a look up the road and down the road never look up? <laughs> These are unseen eyes. Watching you. So I heard from Pastor. Look up. I love this. We said no behind hide from Pastor. Look up. Now for your brother and your sister. Look up. No, don't get nice now. Because we are called to praise Him in our ways. Praise, yes. praise Him in our walking. Yes. And praise Him in our talking. Yes. Praise Him. Yes. For He make us praisers. Yes. He took us out of darkness. Yes. And praise Him in the marvelous light for we to praise Him. Yes. We are praisers of God. Yes. So let us praise Him in the morning. Yes. Praise him in the evening. Praise him when the sun goes down. For it's worthy to be praised. Let us who is on earth. Praise him. Praise him all the angels. Praise him. All above the earth. Praise him. Let all who he command. Praise him. For a command and they were created. Praise him. Let all on earth praise the name of our Lord Jesus Christ. His name is alone. His name alone is excellent. The Lord take pleasure in his children who praise his holy name. So let us praise him in the sanctuary. And you are in the heavens above. Praise him. Praise him for our mighty works. Praise him for his unweak equal greatness. Let us praise him with the blast of the ram's horn. Let us praise him with psalm tree and heart. Let us praise him with the timbrel and the dancing. Let us praise him with all the string instruments and the flutes. Let us praise him to the cross of the symbol. Let us praise him to the loud sound in symbol. Come on, everybody, let loose. Let all the people praise him. Let everything, let our breath, sing praise unto him. Sing praise unto the most holy God, the most high God. Praise him. Let's lose and praise him. Hallelujah. 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 Glory, glory. Praise him. Praise him and worship him. Hallelujah. Oh Lord, oh Lord, oh Lord, oh Lord. Yeah. This song God by extreme praise and worship. We are God the boast and the Lord with a passion. The Psalms, this Psalms 150 cover all who that is in the temple and the church 
must be going to praise and worship God in a forceful manner. Do it in a rage. Which means you are to become wild in your praise. You must show in your praise and attitude and extreme enthusiasm. So are you ready to give praise a shot? Are you ready to put on your dancing shoes and praise the Lord in dance? Well, let us worship the Lord in the beauty of holiness. Come on, sing. Give him all honor, all glory. Let the redeem of the Lord this go. Hallelujah. Yeah. When the spirit of the Lord is upon me, I dance like David dance. When the spirit of the Lord is upon me, I dance like David dance. I dance, I dance, I dance, I dance, dance like David dance. I dance, I dance, I dance, I dance, dance like David dance. When the spirit of the Lord is upon me, I dance like David dance. When the spirit of the Lord is up on me, I dance like David dance. I dance, I dance, I dance, I dance, dance like David dance.